It is Thursday and time to check in now with Steve Caparizzo. He has this morning's Pet Connection Extra. Cap. Thanks, Christina. Last week, it was all about prevention in the care of our pet's teeth. This week, what happens when the tartar builds up and there is dental disease developing? This is something you can't brush away. You need to have a professional dental cleaning. They do have to go under anesthesia for that, and the reason for that is obviously they're not going to keep their mouth open while we scale their teeth. Even the best of dogs won't do that. They're monitored closely under anesthesia um, with lots of monitoring equipment and things like that to make sure everything is as safe as possible. How do you actually clean the teeth? When we're talking about a, a doing a professional dental, we're talking about scaling the teeth, usually with an ultrasonic scaler, and that really kind of goes and takes all that tartar, goes below the gum line, really takes all of that down, and, and we probe the teeth, make sure that there's no um, pockets and investigating any periodontal disease that they have, any fractures. A lot of animals will have fractures of their teeth. We can investigate that sort of thing. Professional dental work by veterinarian is very similar to going to your dentist. Um, we do have uh, a high-speed drill unit that we use as well, so a lot of dogs will have uh, dogs will have multiple rooted teeth, teeth, and we have to section those teeth before we take out take them out. And um, we do the polisher just like we would do you have on your teeth after you get them cleaned. They always do the polish afterwards. It's a very important step after you clean dogs and cats' mouths as well. You want to make sure that they're getting polished appropriately so that you're not um, creating any scratch on the tooth and uh, having tartar be able to build up quicker after that. Why is it so important to have your pet's teeth cleaned? If you're not having the dental um, tartar and things taken off of, of the teeth and having dental cleanings, then all that bacteria is just sitting right at the gum line and it's a perfect avenue to get into the bloodstream and that can go to different places in the body. Thanks, Dr. Jackie. Most of the time, it's a day procedure, and once they wake up, they can be sent home within a couple of hours. This is just to be sure everything is okay, and they're not in any kind of discomfort. They should be all set when they get home. Back to eating, and back to having a healthier life. Back to you, Christina. <laughs>